Hey, what's going on guys? So today I'm gonna review um, Al Rahab uh, perfume oils. And this is the uh, best sellers pack one through three, which has uh, roses, uh, soft, and balkis. So roses, soft, and balkis. And um, it's basically like a sampler pack. I mean, Al Rahab is a perfume maker out of uh, Saudi Arabia and they make a ton of different oils and uh, uh, perfume oils and uh, so these are I guess the, f the first three uh, their best sellers so um, I guess I'm gonna start off with the ones I like least to the ones I like the most so uh, the ones I, the first one that I like the least I'd say is um, soft so um, the reason why is uh, it actually smells pretty good but it's a uh, it's a, it's for women mostly, I'd say. It's a, it's more of a feminine fragrance and not really uh, my cup of tea. Um, according to uh, Frag Fragrantica, I guess how you pronounce it, Fragrantica, they, um, it says it's for women and men, but I think it's for women. But they say uh, the fragrance features woody notes, um, citruses, vetiver, vanilla, caramel, white musk, orchid, and jasmine, and. Uh, yeah, I mean, it seems like a, a bunch of people like it on here, um, much more than they dislike it. But uh, again, I think it's more of a, a, a ladies' fragrance. Uh, not to say it doesn't smell good, but just not my cup of tea. So I think out of uh, ten, I'd probably give this, probably give this a six out of ten. Uh, next, my next uh, least favorite would have to be uh, Balkis. Um, Balkis smells pretty good, um, according to Fragantica, uh, it, it has, um, it was named after the Queen of Sheba and is an oriental feminine fragrance enriched with vanilla. Um, I kind of disagree that it's a feminine fragrance. I think it's actually the most masculine out of the three. It kind of smells, to me it runs you a little bit like chocolate, but, um, I don't know, according to, for, to Fragantica, it has, um, Let's see what it what the what it contains. It contains uh, basically just like three notes. The first one being uh, agarwood. Uh, the second one being uh, I guess it has powdery notes, and then the third one being um, floral notes. So um, I don't know too much about agarwood, but again, it's to me it's uh, you know it. Kind of reminds me of a of, of chocolate in a way, but it definitely smells kind of masculine to me. But yeah, and again, but according to uh, I think uh, all three of them, I believe are unisex colognes. But yeah, so uh, this is my second favorite, uh, least favorite, uh, I guess second favorite, um, and I'd probably rank it, uh, I guess seven out of eight, and it, this can also be pretty strong too. So be careful. Uh, the third one, and I guess my most favorite, would have to be Roses. Uh, I didn't actually uh, like Roses when I first started because it smells it, almost exactly like rose water. And as a matter of fact, it, it only, according to Fragantica, it only has um, two notes, I believe, or th has three notes. Let's see. It has, uh, yeah, basically two notes. The first one being roses, of course, and then it also says there's a musk note. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I, I believe it's, yeah, I think it's unisex. It actually even might be a little feminine, but the, you know, it smells uh, pretty good. And if, if you, uh, like, let's say you put it on and like maybe uh, you uh, wash, or take a shower, there's still a hint of it, you know, or if you just like, put some water over the area there's still a hint of it and it's a nice subtle smell and it, it I don't think it'll clash with other uh, fragrances that you have on you know maybe you might have on a body spray or deodorant so yeah out of, out of 10 I'd probably give roses uh, 8 out of 10 and this was probably the only one that I'd consider buying again maybe Balkis but this one so yeah all in all I'd say uh, you know if I was to I'm, I'm still on the fence I'm gonna try out other uh, I guess sampler packs are the best sellers, but yeah, uh, Roses is pretty good, and as you can see, it's the one I use the most. It's almost done. It's not that much in there. All right, oops.
All right, so that's it for now. Peace.